Hello world, my name is Ethan. Today I'm going to, do, to be showing you how to install, set up, and use a program called Views. It will allow you to install torrents from anything, anything from music to movies to DV shows to games, which is just great. It's a really great program that everyone should have. Uh, first, I'm going to show you how to install it. Very simple installation, I believe that's the word. Just go to vuze.com, views, and here we are. Uh, there are two types, there's views and views plus. Views plus costs a little bit of money. Views plus also lets you do some things that you're not allowed to do with normal views, which is pretty obvious, of course. You can download movies to DVDs, which is really cool if you're into, like, selling DVDs and things like that, even though that's illegal. <laughs> but, yeah, uh, you can do a lot with Views Plus, but really, Views by itself is a great, great program, and you don't really need the extra stuff, I guess. Sorry for that, blowing out a candle. Um, here, you just hit download now. And, ow. Um, what will come up is this. Find the installer file, which I already have. Yep, uh, you see, there it is, it's downloading. I'm going to stop that. Um, but, yeah, it's 7.2 megabytes, so it should be very quick. should take about 20 seconds. And once you just double-click on that, and... One second, minimizing. Here, this is your views installer. You double-click on that. Uh, I'm not going to do it. It's not allowing me because I already have it downloaded. But you will have a screen pop up and you will have to agree to terms and service and type in your password to allow it to download and then install and once it's installed it should be very easy I, re I imagine you're all smart people you can figure it out um, it's very straightforward they pretty much tell you everything you need to do here you go this is views it's a great program, and it has a similar setup as iTunes. Similar. Uh, not exact, you know. But, uh, see, I've got a lot of stuff like Nirvana or Green Day or Dexter and Breaking Bad. And, see, I even have Call of Duty downloading, which I stopped. Um, and, see, uh, TV shows, they can range from 3 to probably 5 gigabytes. And I know that's a lot, but don't be worried. After you watch it, you can just you just highlight it. Uh, you can press delete, and it will ask you if you want to move it to trash or delete it from your computer. If you move it to your trash, it's still going to take up the space, so just delete it from your computer, and then it's gone, and you have all that space back. So, I'm going to show you how to download some music today because music is the fastest thing to download. But, before we do that, you see, if you go to the search, when you first get on, it's going to take you here to the web search. So, today I'm going to be downloading an album by Asking Alexandria. So you can just search that up there. And web search will come up. And see, it's like you binged it. So you can use this as a browser I don't recommend it I don't like it very much as a browser but otherwise it's great you don't need to use this because you're looking for torrents so you just use meta search or yeah uh, and see I have a ton of uh, things <laughs> um, I got a ton of results from different sites like Internet Archive uh, that's just views, I believe. Oh, no, that's Veritor, or I don't know what that is exactly. 
uh, torrent portal. Uh, my favorite is a site called kickasstorrents.com. Um, but, you see, I've got a ton of these. But, when you first download it, you will only have one or two. And you will have very few results. See, I got 163. Without it, you'd get maybe 10. And they wouldn't, then they probably wouldn't be good. Um, so, I minimize that because I need to get templates. So, I'm going to open up a new tab. Oops. And just search use templates. Oops, I added the little bar thing. But anyway, here, this is what you want. It's your second thing to come up. And it's got 17 search templates. So you're going to be searching like 19, 20 sites. So that's going to get you a ton of results. You can get more, but really, this trust me, this will get you what you need. Just click there. And sorry for the meet a real Russian woman ad. <laughs> but you click on one of these, either or. And, um, well, it will go up in your downloads. Sorry for that. Uh, it'll go up in your downloads. And then you just click on it. You might not even have to click on it. And it pretty much runs itself. You might have to agree in a little bar. But other than that, yep, they'll all be checked. Uh, this one is locked. I don't know why, but the other ones are all good. The ones that you care about, such as Kick-Ass Torrents or Pirate Bay. Um, so that's a lot of good sites. And so, as you can see, when you search for this, you get a ton of results. High, medium, low. It doesn't really matter. They're all going to download pretty well. See, this one has a lot of seeds and peers. I'm not exactly sure what they are, sorry. Uh, but... Uh, I know that the more you have, the faster it's going to download. Uh, and also, if you're worried about viruses, well, have no worries, because Views has a virus checker. Before it, before you get it, before it installs, it will check it for viruses and make sure that your computer does not get all screwed up. So, uh, what do I want to download? I look at my uh, options. Let's go with this one. Actually, uh, no, I'm not going to go with that one simply because uh, it doesn't tell me the size and it doesn't tell me how many seeds appear, so it's looking a little sketchy. Uh, you generally get a lot more, but this isn't the most popular band. I guess I'm just going to go with this one. Or, no, this one. I apologize for that. Uh, but yep, this will come up. Uh, this is not the actual download. This is checking, virus checking. And then here you can go into downloading. And here it is. And it shows you how fast you're moving. See, it was very low because nothing was downloading. But as you can see, it'll get up to maybe 350 kilobytes a second. And that's really good, really fast. Uh oh. It's going. Oh, I know why. I just had some people come in with iPads. And so they're taking up some of my network. So this might take a bit longer than expected. But still very fast. See, 2 minutes and 12 seconds. It's very fast. Very, very fast. Uh, so. See, it's 10.06. I will resume when it is downloaded. All right. As soon as it's done, it just pops out of here and goes into new or library, either or. See, here's Asking Alexandria. You click on the little arrow, and it'll point down. And see, this is a small little, like, LP or, or not even EP or, I don't know. I'm not totally sure. It's a short album. But, yep, here it all is. And you can listen to that. Some of, most, not most. About half of them have cover art to go into iTunes, which is cool, but otherwise, you know, it's not needed. But yeah, it's very fast. Um, but a good thing about it, some people don't, you know, most people don't just want to, like, have to go into views to listen to the music or download, and because you can't download it into, like, your iPod or iPad. So, it does have an iTunes option. You can download it into a lot of stuff here under device playback. 
Um, you see, we've got a lot of stuff. These are people around me, computers, my neighbors, and stuff like that. But here's iTunes. See, I even can do it to my PlayStation or even my Xbox. Um, so, uh, what you're going, what to get into iTunes, you just have to drag it. See, it becomes a little square into iTunes. But before we do that, because you're new, you just click on it and you will have to download the iTunes. I'm not totally sure what it's called. I apologize for that. I really do. But all I know is that it's ridiculously quick and it's really easy. A box will pop up. Just click download and it'll take about 30 seconds. And then it's all good. So what you do is you can drag that little square into it. Make sure it has the little plus sign in the corner. Uh, the little green plus sign. And just drop it. And this will come up. Uh, this is playback for a lot of things. Uh, you need that for video to put it on these devices. But uh, because this is music, I can just click Do Not Transcode, and I will be able to put it on all of these devices um, and listen to it on my computer. So all I have to do is click Do Not Transcode, and watch how fast this is. I'm going to move over to iTunes. If it'll let me. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> while it's doing that, uh, you can also do it with, like I said, you can do it with PlayStation and Xbox, which is great. Uh, you can do it also if you're not on my computer specifically, because I have the MacBook and not the MacBook Pro or Air, but you can put it up on uh, your. Uh, the Apple TV, your movies and videos that is, you can always put music on it, no matter what you have. But see, it's already on. Here it is. Look at that. Um, but I'm not going to play it for you simply because of copyright laws. I apologize for that. But I do promise you that these are high quality they are, you know, they're not going to sound different than any of these other songs. And so, you know, that's why Views is such a great program. I'm, it's everything that iTunes has to offer for free. And it's very simple. You don't have to use any sketchy websites or type in any weird codes or anything. That's what you people probably think. <laughs> but it's just a great program and uh, for videos you don't need to you can move it to iTunes it's the same for music but you can just watch it all on views so I can go to my library and I can go to Dexter and I can you know watch season 4 episode 12 <laughs> just click play and it pops up and it's real it's that easy so I encourage everyone out there to download this fine program that will make their life a little more enjoyable. Uh, also, here you have um, these uh, seeds and peers. Those are going out to other people to help them download. It's not really needed, but it makes other people's download faster. It's like giving out to your com community. So just let them do that. It'll take forever, but whatever. And if you, like I said, if you want to delete them, just go ahead, delete them off your computer, and you'll get your space back. So, uh, in conclusion, uh, you saw albums take about two, three, four minutes. Um, movies take around an hour, one to two hours, uh, depending on your internet speed. Uh, as you can see down here, it's below a kilobyte just because I'm not downloading anything right now. Uh, seasons can take probably three or four hours. So, yeah, you know, it involves a little bit of waiting. But, as you can see, it's really wonderful and, that, you know, everyone should have it. So, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, I hope to upload more videos in the future on how to do other things via Mac.
And so, you know, have a great day. Bye.